Hey everybody, Justin Cena here. In this video, I'm gonna teach you how to set up one-click post-purchase upselling in your Shopify store. It's gonna be incredibly powerful, and we'll jump right into it. This is all about one-click upselling and how to do it the right way. And every single store on Shopify, or really any e-commerce store in general, needs to integrate upselling. And if you don't know what upselling is, it's basically the idea of when someone buys a product, you're gonna go ahead and offer them another product, maybe something similar or complimentary, maybe your top product, different ways to do it, and I'll show you how to set this up. But the idea is that you're gonna be able to sell more and boost profits. Really, the idea is that we're gonna get people to buy more. We're gonna boost their AOV, which means average order value. We're gonna get people to spend more every single time they check out by creating these one-click upsells. And a popular strategy for Shopify is to integrate one-click post-purchase upsells and downsells to increase average order value quickly and easily. It's incredibly powerful. I'll walk you through how to do it. But there are some pain points that you might run into when you go ahead and set this up. First of all, there is no built-in way to do this with Shopify. You're gonna need to use an app. The app must be super easy to use and require no prior technical skills. You don't need to be a coder or a developer in order to work or to get this working. And most importantly, the app must be able to have one-click purchasing, upsells, downsells, and custom thank you pages. And if you wanna get all that, you're gonna use the Arc app. This is what I use. This is what I highly recommend. You see the link directly below this video. I'm gonna walk you through exactly how to use Arc and why it's the best one-click upselling app in Shopify. So this is the Arc post-purchase upsell app. You see the link directly below this video. And the first thing that you should notice is almost a perfect 4.9 out of five star reviews and over 60 reviews here. Arc is the best option when it comes to post-purchase one-click upselling on Shopify. The bottom line is you're gonna sell more with these one-click upsells, with these custom thank you pages, with these surveys, it's all included in Arc, and it's all about instantly boosting revenue with these one-click upsells and these post-purchase upsells. We wanna increase our average order value. And I'm gonna walk you through this app, but you see it's a very easy to set up kind of idea here where we see everything visually, triggers, upsells, downsells, thank you pages. We get to have everything set up here visually. So it's very easy for anyone to understand, even if this is the first time that you're working with upselling. Really great app, one-click upsell is of course the main feature and here you get to customize exactly how it looks. You get to change everything, you get to brand everything, you get to have control of how these pages look so you can inc uh, incorporate your brand in this upselling strategy. So you got your one-click upselling, you have an endless thank you page customization options. You could include different offers, you could show different products, you could add text, you could add timers, you could add more content, right? Incredibly powerful, very easy to set up all inside of the app. Incredibly simplistic, really, to do some really cool customizations as well. So really, they've thought of everything when it comes to this app. And it's, again, Arc. You see the link directly below this video. All you need to do is press the Install button over here. I already have this app installed, so I'm going to go and show you how this is set up in one of my stores. We'll come over here and click Open App. And this is gonna bring us into our dashboard here for the Arc app. And there's a couple of different, this is exactly what you're gonna see when you first install the app. A little kind of a welcome message here talking about publishing your first funnel. And it's really easy to do. We're gonna go and click this publish starter funnel. If you've already installed the app, you could also get over here into purchase events or really into products as well. So first things first, we wanna come over here and we wanna define Arc as our post purchase upselling app. So we need to go into settings, and in the checkout section, we're gonna go ahead and select our post-purchase app. This is inside of our Shopify settings. So here we go. Arc will now make the save here. Now we'll be able to go back into the Arc app, and we'll see as I reload this page that we uh, won't have that message anymore because we've set and defined Arc as our post-purchase upselling app. Step one, very easy, right? Step two, all we need to do now is set up our funnel. So you see it's all visual here, right? We have the entire kind of setup here and you could write a review for them. That would be great once you uh, find this to be helpful. We're gonna go in over here and you see exactly what's happening with these colored buttons. Okay, and literally it's great to walk through this in just plain English. 
because it allows you to really understand how this is going to work. So when an order is completed, right, this is a post-purchase upsell. So an order is completed, right, and we can come over here and look at the triggers. Uh, we have a, the ability to kind of get a little bit more specific. We could show this funnel only to a percentage of customers. Let's say 20% uh, of customers see it. We could schedule this funnel to only show for these specific start and end dates. We can show based on rules, right? Or we could just leave these triggers blank. And anytime an order is completed, we will start the upsell, okay? So different triggers here. Now we come over here and we have our upsell, okay? And you see that there's a little line over here. This is the customer's journey. So now the customer is going to be presented a one-click upsell. And you see it says first upsell over here. Okay, this is important to dictate because we have upsells, we have downsells, we have multiple upsells, we have multiple thank you pages, right? There are just different journeys here as you see the different lines as you follow. So on each area here for upsells or downsell pages or thank you pages, we have the ability to come over here and view our analytics, right? Of course, we just created this, so this isn't going to be showing anything, but we come over here to edit offer. Okay, now you see what we're seeing here, right? And we could change the title of this as well. But now we have the page, the customization, the ability to come over here. We show our product options, okay? Which product are we going to source? Is it a specific product? Is it the cheapest? Is it a specific collection, right? We come over here. Now we can actually select a specific product in our catalog. Let's say I always want to make the Downy Av shirt be our upsell because it's one of our most popular, right? We come over here, we now show, we could even change the default variant. So we want the blue one to be shown because that looks really nice. We have that over here. Of course, they have their variant options and all that other great stuff, but we can literally dictate exactly what we want to have in here. We could change the title, right? So we can come over here and do something like add that, right? One time offer and then put that over there, right? We could put it to anything. Your getting a special offer just for you. Our most popular hoodie, all roads lead to Downey. All right, you can customize everything here. Customize the text color, right? Maybe you want it to be green. Customize the text size, the spacing, show the product description, add your own product description, customize everything in here right, variant pickers, right? And that's just in the product option. So the idea here is that we're gonna customize our setup here. We're gonna customize everything. We're gonna customize the text. We're gonna customize the color. We're gonna customize the price display. We're gonna customize the, dis, uh, the summary options. And we could add a timer in there as well. Right, you see the text offer expires in limited time only, ends in, right? Now we have our own custom timer here. Right, this app has everything and it's all very visual in terms of just needing to point and click. We can come over here, take a preview of how it's gonna look on mobile as well. Of course, this app works very well on mobile. It's super important for things to work well on mobile on e-commerce, so Arc has that covered as well. And now we'll simply just save. And now that we've saved it, we've customized this, right? And we can do the same thing for all of these different journeys. So let's say customer orders, they then see an upsell, Let's say they accept the upsell. Okay, great. Now we're gonna show them a second upsell. Okay, and the same thing goes over here. Now we go over and create our own thing. We come over product options and let's show a different product over here. Now I'll do the T-shirt of the month club. So I'll add that in there and I'll save that. <coughs> we have our downsell, right? So let's say they show the upsell and they decline. We now show them a downsell, right? Same thing. Product options, maybe I'll come over here, I'll do least expensive product for the downsell. Okay, and of course we can fully customize all these pages. Same thing goes for our downsells and our upsells, just kind of just the same idea here. We have our thank you pages as well. So we have the whole ability to set up our thank you pages and add different kind of promoted products. You see the ability for us to do product upsells or birthday collectors where they enter in their birthday. This is really cool because we get to have this inside of our, uh, or of their customer note, we could send them something like a birthday uh, discount. Very cool. And you see the journey. Multiple journeys, starting with order completed, 
show an upsell, they might take it. If they take it, they'll see the second upsell. If they decline, they'll see the first downsell. After that, if they accept it, they'll go to thank you page one. If they decline, they'll go to thank you page two. See all the different journeys, all the different variations. You have individual control of each and every one of them. And another cool thing, you can create an A-B test here. So now we can go over here. We can either copy our existing or we can create a brand new one over here. And now we could try two different upsells. And of course, we could edit each one individually. So this is a really cool option. We're going to say, okay, I'm going to uh, go between my most popular product and my most expensive. Okay, here's my most popular variant A. Here's my most expensive variant B. And we'd be able to go ahead and take a look at the analytics and say, okay, wow, uh, variant A is making us a lot more money than variant B. We can go ahead and then remove that uh, split test because we've kind of proven it to already work. So that's the whole idea here. And then when you're ready, you simply press save. And that's all that you need to do. It's incredibly powerful here. That's fully set up here. Our starter funnel is now fully set up and ready to go. And if someone was to order something in our store, they're now gonna get this one-click upsell shown right over here. And if they decline, they'll get the downsell. If they accept and buy it, they'll get another upsell. If they accept and buy that, they'll get uh, sent to the thank you page number one. Incredibly easy here. So we have our funnel, and again, in our dashboard here, we will now be able to see our stats. Now that we have our first funnel running over here, you'll see your number of revenue in terms of how much you're making, your upsells, your conversion rate, all the different stats about your funnel. You can turn off the funnel if you want in terms of turning this off and just kind of uh, pausing this for now. You can come over here and also delete if you want. You could duplicate, you could edit it at any time. They have great support as well. You get live chat support. You could also schedule a meeting with them. Lots of different settings in here as well. In terms of order notes and order tagging, you could set up custom tagging. You can collect birthday information. You could even run surveys as well, which is really cool. You could do a post-purchase survey, collecting information. ARC has thought of it all. That's why I highly recommend it. You see the link directly below this video. It's an incredibly powerful app. It's an app that you absolutely need in your store. Make sure you install it. Take advantage of that great 30-day free trial and watch how this helps increase your average order value.